everyone. It's a beautiful day in the meadow. Are you ready for some giggles and fun? Hi, Bunny. I love sunny days. Let's tell some jokes. Yes, jokes make everything better. Do you want to hear my first joke? Yes, please. What do you call a bunny with a large brain? Hmm, I don't know. What? An egghead! That was funny, Bunny. I want to tell a joke, too. Go for it, Jack! Okay. Why did the teddy bear say no to dessert? I don't know. Why? Because he was stuffed. Let's slide down and tell more jokes. Yes, I love sliding. Okay, here's another one. What do you call a sleeping bull? Hmm, what? A bulldozer! Do you want to hear a joke too? Let's all tell jokes together. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I will guide you to make a video like before. Now we will go into the detailed practice part. First we will need to have a script for the story. So I will use an AI tool to help us write scripts. That tool is called Gravity Write. You will visit Gravity Right. I will put the URL link below the YouTube video description. We will proceed to create an account with email or link directly to a Google account. I choose to link directly to my Google account. So after you successfully register an account, we will see the working interface as follows. This is the kids video script generator function. In addition to raw Gravity Right, there are many other functions. Today, we just need to pay attention to Kids Video Script Generator. Next step, you will need a topic to write a script. For example, here I will write the topic jokes and joy. Next, I will set up some necessary information such as target audience, characters in the script, video duration. Please pay attention and practice. After we have set the parameters, I will proceed with create content. So this is the script result we get. So after preparing the script, I will convert each character's script to AI voice. I will use the 11 labsao tool to create voices for each character. So I will register an account with Google. So we have successfully registered an account. Next I'm going to go back to the script. First, I will copy each line of the bunny character's script and convert them into voice. So I will copy the first sentence and paste it into Eleven Labs. Now I will choose a suitable voice for this character. You can choose from some of the available voices here, or we can find other voices as follows. I'll go to find more voices and search with keywords. For example, I'm searching with a keyword called kawaii. I will give it a listen with the results found. Hey, I'm Arisita! I might be a little ditzy, but I'm a lot... So this voice is very suitable for my character, I will choose it as follows.
After choosing a suitable voice, I proceed to generate void. Hi everyone! It's a beautiful day in the meadow. Are you ready for some giggles and fun? Next, I will download this void file and name the file according to the script dialog order. Similarly, I will do the remaining lines of the character bunny. So I have created all the void files of the bunny character. Next I will do the same for the character Jack. Please follow along. So I have prepared all the void voice files for the characters Bunny and Jack. And the next step I will create cartoon characters for Bunny and Jack, combining animation with AI voice. We will access the website address new.express.adobe.com. I will put the URL link under the YouTube video description. After accessing the express.adobe website address, we will see the following working interface. You will go to the character section to choose a character for the character. There are many characters here for you to choose from. First, I will choose character for the character bunny. I will go to animals. I will choose the character Cho bunny as a rabbit. We will choose the green background, so that we can then edit and delete the green video background easily. I've chosen a blue background here. In the next step, you will turn on the enhanced speech function. Then you will import the voice file or record directly using the record function available here. The purpose of this is to synchronize the voice with the character's animation status. I already have the character's voices, so the next step is to upload them and sync them with the characters. So we finished our first video for Bunny. Hi everyone!
everyone! It's a beautiful day in the meadow! Are you ready for some giggles and fun? I will proceed with the download. Next we will do it in turn with the remaining void files. Yes! Jokes make everything better! Do you want to hear my first joke? So I have finished generating animation videos for Bunny. And next, I will proceed to do the same for the character Jack. Please follow along. First I will choose a character for Jack. I will choose this character. Next I will synchronize the character's voice. Hi Bunny, I love sunny days. Let's tell some jokes. We will do the same with the remaining lime sections. Okay, so I have prepared the animation videos for the two characters Bunny and Jack. Next we will create background animation videos. You can base on some of the following suggestions to get ideas for creating a background. I will use Canva to create background animation videos. We will create a video project with Canva. Next, I will start the process of creating background animation. Please pay attention and follow along.
So I have completed the process of creating a very detailed and complete animation video. Next we will export these videos. I will choose share and choose download. Select MP for video format. Or the second way to get background animations. You can search from available sources like the website here. I will put the URL below the video description. I will try searching for a keyword related to the topic. And we have some free results here. I will try to select this video and download it. After we have prepared everything, we will start editing the video with CapCut PC software. I started creating a new project with CapCut PC. First I will import all the resource files into the screenshot. Are you ready for the battle? Please watch the video carefully and I will guide you in the most detailed way with all my enthusiasm. I will insert a background animation for the first scene. We will choose the video ratio again. Now compare with the script and arrange the animation videos of the characters to match the order of dialogue in the script. So we have the first specific scene as follows. So I will select the Bunny01 video file and insert that video into the timeline. Next I will remove the blue background in the bunny video using the chromakey function in CapCut. I'll adjust bunny's position on the background. I did the same for the jack video, greening the video, and adjusting jack's position. Now we will need to add a video of bunny listening while jack speaks, and vice versa, a video of Jack listening to Bunny speaking. I will review the generate videos one by one to look for video frames that we can use. The purpose is to create videos showing the character Bunny listening to Jack and vice versa, Jack listening to Bunny speaking. So here I can separate and use some video frames in this video to make a video of Jack listening to Bunny talk. I will remove the green background in the video. Next I will adjust the Jack character so that the video layer above will match the position of the video layer below. I'll right click on the video layer below and select the copy attributes feature. Now we have copied all the properties of the video layer below. Then you will paste it onto the video layer above. So Jack's position in the video layer above matches the position of the video layer below. Next I will proceed to split the video frame to get the seconds showing that Jack is listening. I 
I separate the segments that need to get frames. I will delete inappropriate video frames. I will combine these segments and then duplicate them to make the video longer. So we have finished making the video of Jack listening to Bunny talk. Next we need a video of Bunny standing and listening to Jack speak. Similarly, I will look for videos with appropriate video frames that express the emotions Bunny is listening to. So here I will use this video. I will insert the text into the timeline and remove the green background of the video. I copied the bunny position in the video layer below and pasted it into the video layer above. I will move the video to a timeline that matches the scene where Jack is speaking. Similarly, I will stretch the timeline and separate the video frames that need to be used, like I just did for Jack. After splitting, I select this part, then I will duplicate it to create a longer video. I will check out the video demo. Pretty good but I want to slow down bunny speed. First I select all the bunny clips then right click and create compound clip. Then we're going to slow down this video.
Similarly, I will create compound clip here. I will compare the script and continue editing the remaining conversations of scene 1. Please pay attention and follow.
So I have finished editing the first scene of the video. I will see the results. Hi everyone! It's a beautiful day in the meadow. Are you ready for some giggles and fun? Hi Bunny, I love sunny days. Let's tell some jokes. Yes, jokes make everything better. Do you want to hear my first joke? Yes, please. What do you call a bunny with a large brain? Hmm, I don't know. What? An egghead! It's wonderful, isn't it? Now to add more life to the video, I will add some sound. For example, I will find a funny laugh to place at the time when Bunny talks about the answer. Some sounds to add. For example, I will search for keywords. Laughter C. I will choose this laughter. Hi everyone! It's a beautiful day in the meadow. Are you ready for some giggles and fun? Hi Bunny! I love sunny days. Let's tell some jokes. Yes! Jokes make everything better. Do you want to hear my first joke? Yes, please. What do you call a bunny with a large brain? Hmm... I don't know. What? An egghead! Very good. Next I will proceed with editing the remaining scenes. Please pay attention and practice with me.
so I have finished editing the sections. Now I will add caption effects to make the video more vivid. Hi everyone! It's a beautiful day in the meadow. Are you ready for some giggles and fun? Hi Bunny, I love sunny days. Let's tell some jokes. Yes! Jokes make everything better. Do you want to hear my first joke? Yes, please. What do you call a bunny with a large brain? Hmm, I don't know. What? An egghead! That was funny, Bunny. I want to tell a joke too. Go for it, Jack! Okay. Why did the teddy bear say no to dessert? I don't know. Why? Because he was stuffed. Let's slide down and tell more jokes. Yes, I love sliding. Okay, here's another one. What do you call a sleeping bull? Hmm, what? A bulldozer! Do you want to hear a joke too? Let's all tell jokes together. So I show you the most detailed and complete way to create a perfect animated video. Hope you will like it. Please support my enthusiasm by liking the video and subscribing to the channel, so I have more motivation to make new videos. Thank you for accompanying me until this moment, goodbye and see you again.